you talk about the path to prosperity and peace in the region that we have to try and find out of this. Um, is normalization of, of, of relations with Israel now off the table for Saudi Arabia? Obviously not this week, but when you, when you think about that path. You know, when those discussions were taking place and His Royal Highness the Crown Prince was clear that it is contingent on a pathway to peace, uh, peaceful resolution of the Palestinian questions. That, were, that was on the table, it remains on the table. And obviously the setback over the last uh, month has brought that, has clarified why was Saudi Arabia so adamant that resolution of the Palestinian conflict has to be part of a broader uh, normalization in the Middle East, which again, goes back to the Arab peace plan that was put forward by Saudi Arabia decades ago that, that saw a way forward for a, for a normal Middle East where all countries in the Middle East would have, uh, would have normal relationships and would be focusing on economic prosperity, which is, which is the common theme today. From uh, the regional uh, transition to a region of prosperity I think it reminds us of something that has existed uh, in the Middle East for many, many decades, since the 1940s, which is a big part of the Middle East. The Palestinian people have had their basic rights uh, you know, taken away and uh, their right for statehood uh, and peaceful existence uh, unfulfilled, and it's time to use this awful uh, situation now to bring that to the fore and to resolve it. Saudi Arabia has put forward the Arab peace plan uh, for uh, a long time uh, and we remain uh, eager to see that plan come into fruition through a peaceful process. You will see this week in the next few days Saudi Arabia convening an emergency Arab summit in Riyadh you will see Saudi Arabia convening an Africa-Saudi summit in Riyadh, and in a few days, you will see Saudi Arabia convening an Islamic uh, summit. And uh, in the short term, the objective of bringing uh, these three summits and other gatherings under the leadership of Saudi Arabia would be to drive towards a peaceful resolution of uh, the conflict.